Hello everyone, happy Monday. It is currently 10 past four and that is the first time I've picked up my camera today. Dan and I have literally just been chatting all day. It's been a really nice day so far. We've had some like really in, we always have like really in depth combos about like different things that we discuss and issue like world issues and like deep convos like it's just been really nice and i just love that we can do that i just think it's so sick so yeah we've literally just been doing that all day now it's 10 past four i've got up whacked on my gym clothes which is the same gym clothes i had on yesterday have i put it on inside out um but i loved it so much i whacked it in the wash wash overnight and put them back on my hair is an absolute mess but you know i'm going gym so I don't need it to be tidy. Then I'm going to come back and I don't know if I mentioned it in last week's vlog, but we started buying HelloFresh. Casey has been buying HelloFresh for months now. And my older sister had like a free code. So I used it and really liked it. Then we got an email from HelloFresh saying that they wanted to work with us. So we were so excited because obviously we'd already used it. It was something we already had, you know, bought organically. So I'm going to be cooking a HelloFresh meal later uh, for dinner for Dan and I, which is going to be so nice. I don't actually know what's in the HelloFresh box. I can't remember what meals I chose. So that's always a nice little surprise as well. I'm also going to nip to Sainsbury's to get some like rotisserie chicken because I'm going to use that for my lunch for the next few days. And yeah, that's kind of, that's kind of what's going on. I've been to the gym eight days in a row this will be the eighth day in a row now very very proud of myself i'm absolutely smacking it um it makes me just feel so you know positive uplifted it's a very like i don't know it's just such a nice feeling i love it after i go to the gym and obviously like the hard work at the gym it's just i don't know i really like it so i'm so glad that i've got back into it but for now we're gonna head to the gym i've got my bcas in my uh bottle it's a long island iced tea flavor and it's unreal i actually hate the taste of just normal water so i never ever have normal water so these bcas are perfect because they taste unreal yeah i've got to go to b and q also on the way home and pick up some weed killer because dan needed some weed killer for the patio i think out the front or around the back i'm not sure so that's what i'm doing just now let's go have a smashing monday let's do it hello everyone and welcome to the goosey kitchen Hey, welcome to the, welcome to the Kitchen. So today we are, as I mentioned in the car, going to be making a HelloFresh meal for dinner. I can't tell you how starving I am. I can't wait to eat. Tonight I'm going to be making fragrant chicken curry with zesty rice. And it looks unreal. So the best thing about HelloFresh is every single week they have over 35 recipes to choose from, which is a lot quite a lot of recipes yeah i mean you're not gonna eat 30 dinners in a week in a week so. anyway so there's so many different options that you can choose from it's fresh ingredients straight to your door too so it means you'll have to take less trips to the supermarket so as i said i'm gonna be, be making the fragrant chicken curry and what i really like about this this is like a little simple pleasure that i like everything's color coordinated and everything i need is in here and then the chicken breast fillets also which comes in the refrigerator part of the box so all the fresh ingredients are sourced from local british suppliers when they can which i also find is amazing you've got all of the veg all of the like sachets flavorings everything that you need in this little thing which obviously can be recycled which is super amazing also this is for two people as well you can do it for more people you can do it for only one person it depends like what your lifestyle is but yeah let's get going with this if i should fall just go ahead go and catch me baby Dan, how smells, how smells nice does this taste? It smells really nice, does it taste? <laughs> how good does this 
bro. I can't wait to eat this. I'm not gonna lie, I already tasted a little bit of the courgette just to make sure it was cooked. So hot. Oh my god, that is so creamy. That smell really good. Actually, take. Do you want to have a little bit of yeah, tasty taste? Oh, that's banging. How good is that? I can't believe how affordable they are. They are from £3.25 per meal per person. So it's definitely going to save you money. I am actually obsessed. Very quick meal as well. Yeah, that literally took like 20, 25 minutes. I don't think it took as long as it said it took. Mm. Winner, winner, chicken dinner, quite literally. Goosey dinner. So guys, if you're a bit like me and you feel like you need a little bit of help with your meals, a little bit of structure, make sure you try out HelloFresh. I'm gonna leave all of the information down in the description. It's also gonna be a little discount code on screen in case you do wanna try it out and you want a little, you know, some money off, obviously, it's always good. So yeah, make sure you try it out. As I said, over 36 recipes per week. It's honestly such a winner. You definitely just can't go wrong. So make sure you check it out. And uh, I'm gonna go finish my dinner. See you later. I uh, literally, I'm not lying. I think this is about three minutes later. <laughs> and look at my bowl. That was unreal. Guys, now it's time for Fortnite. It's my favorite time of the night. I just faced Sam, Sean and Brie to ask if they're coming on and they are, which is just the best news ever. Got my drinks out of the drinks fridge. Dan's got his. Pass me the one that you've been drinking. That you said it's really buff. I was telling you guys about this. Pineapple and grapefruit crush. It literally tastes like Lilt, but better, I think. Tesco's, man. Sainsbury's. Sainsbury's. Yeah, it's actually banging. Like it's better than Lilt, I think. Yeah, I agree. It's so good. Um, you're getting all of the food and drink recommendations over here. So, yeah, it's fortnight time. Then we're going to go to bed. Tomorrow, I think it's going to be a very busy day with work. So, hopefully, I can record as much as I possibly can for you guys. Um, and, yeah, that's it. Thanks so much for being here. So guys, I absolutely smashed the gym and I was greeted by Daniel picking me up um, and he bought me some flowers. What was the occasion? Uh, no occasion. No occasion, just she good for the goosey. goosey. Thanks baby. How pretty. What a nice thing to do. I'm very excited. I'm going to put them in a vase now. Um, I'm also super, oh my God, that's well cool. I know, right? I thought it'd be yeah, oh. definitely. Um, I'm going to put these in a vase and I'm going to get some food because I'm so hungry, but happy, happy, happy. Look at me and my flowers. <laughs> Whoa, you got all the fruits. Roast chicken, coleslaw, and couscous. This looks unreal. Look at the roast chicken. Oh my God. Hello everyone. Happy Thursday? Yep. Happy Thursday. It's actually really late in the evening. I haven't vlogged today because we have had Catherine from Sort My Space out today, sorting out the wardrobe upstairs now. I don't mean to be dramatic, but the improvement is absolutely ridiculous. Over lockdown, that place has just become a dumping ground, really. We haven't really utilised our clothes because we haven't really been getting dressed other than, you know. Same clothes every day. <laughs> Literally, I'm sure some of you can relate. Like, my, as long I have a lot of clothes, but I just haven't been wearing them. I've been wearing the same few outfits just because it's convenient and I'm not leaving the house, so what's the point? Um... So yeah, that's been a bit of a struggle. Um, so we decided to get Catherine in and she absolutely smashed it. She's given us loads of different kind of systems in place um, that's gonna make it super easy for us to keep our wardrobe room in check and make it not overflow like crazy. Um, so Dan, I'm gonna go to the gym. I'm gonna film some bits at the gym for you today. I don't care how busy it is. Huh? 
Dan's going to drive me there um, because I, for the last two days, I've left it quite late. And I feel like when I leave it a little bit later, I do struggle a little bit more with motivation. And honestly, I just don't really like driving. So Dan said he dropped me at the gym, which is really kind of him. Um, and whilst I'm away at the gym, Dan's going to come back and give you a little tour of what is going on upstairs. Everything is still not like spick and span so tidy because we've still got little bits and bobs that we have to organise. Um, but thankfully, we can actually get rid of one of the sets of drawers that's in our bedroom because they were stacked on top of each other. They were very uh, helpful, but at the time, um, it just didn't look that good. It made the room look really kind of small and not as nice so i'm glad that we can now get rid of them and yeah i'm very um i'm very excited to see what that kind of looks like and to reorganize and when amy is eventually allowed to come down here i'm sure she'll have lots of fun organizing labeling etc if anyone didn't know my little sister amy who also does youtube she's a very very organized human being probably the most organized human being i know and uh, loves to label things loves to um you know organize so i'm sure she'll have more fun um doing all of that but yeah we have really appreciated the guidance today and everything that's in there so i'm so excited to show you finally we've been saying it for months but honestly it's just been getting worse and worse as the days goes on dan can you bring down my bottle that's on top of the chest of drawers at the top of the stairs please thank you um so yeah i'm very very excited to show you like not the final wardrobe room because it's not 100 percent finished yet um, but it is definitely, I would say probably 75% done. Uh, so I'm very excited. Also, this is not the most flattering angle you're seeing right underneath my double chin, sweaties. But, you know, my arm is resting. I have arms from yesterday in my arms. I've never done arms before, but I started to use the um, Shreddy app, which is actually really good. This is not sponsored by Shreddy. Um, Amy actually recommended it to me. Um, so I downloaded it yesterday morning used it at the gym yesterday evening and honestly it was so good for keeping me on track i have a bit of a scatterbrain thank you i need to fill this up again a bit of a scatterbrain so gym sometimes is hard to focus on a specific um uh, like regime or a specific you know routine that i've got at the gym so that kind of gives me a bit of variation and a bit of structure in the gym which is definitely needed so yeah i'm going to use my shreddy app again today it's probably going to be about 45 minute to an hour workout i would assume uh today's cardio day um i've actually swapped today's and tomorrow's workouts because today was supposed to be arm day but honestly from the full body workout yesterday i now have aches in my arms so i feel like i'm gonna be better at doing it tomorrow and i'll do cardio today um you know just get those endorphins in make me feel a little bit better i am absolutely exhausted but i do also want to play fortnite i feel like i'm just throwing all of the information at you guys right now but you know i also want to play fortnite tonight because it's a new week this week it was fire week last week and this week it's fish week um which means that i mean if you don't play fortnite feel free to just skip like 30 seconds or whatever um but it means that like all of the fishing stuff's op at the moment so like you're getting loads of cool um fish and it's is it blue guns and up blue and purple guns only from uh fishing which is cool so yeah i'm excited to play fortnite later um hopefully we'll play with brie and sean because we didn't play with them yesterday did we no they had a friend over um for dinner i think um she lives by herself so it's all you know safe they're allowed to do that um but yeah so and we had work to do and then went to bed relatively early for us actually i didn't i went to bed at about 3 p.m about 6am no but we were, yeah you were but i mean we oh, actually yeah, got into in, bed yeah, like yeah. at like 10 o'clock or something yeah. which has been ridiculous in comparison to usual uh but then dan actually didn't go to bed till about 6am because he'd been editing um such a hard working goosey keeper aren't you Come on, let's go and he's pulled us up quickly as he's finishing the vlog oh Hello there, Yasurski. Um, so yeah, just dropped the, dropped the goose off at the gym. 
I've got a few minutes. I'm going to show you around the tidier version of our wardrobe room because obviously we had so many clothes on the floor. Uh, we had too much clothes to be fair. We just had an abundance of clothes and we've got sacks. Dare I show you? I'm going to show you the clothes that have come out of that room in order for us to have a little bit of room to work with. It's been an absolute madness. So yeah, a little bit more organized, a little bit less messy and Hopefully now we can actually start building and getting a little bit more structure in that wardrobe room until it's spick and span. You feel me? Okay, so I've got a bit of time. Let me stop rambling. Let me stop chatting and I'll show you around um, and you can obviously see for yourself. First and foremost, these are the sacks of clothes that have come out of that wardrobe room. So this is all stuff that we are getting rid of um, in one way or another. So yeah, just to give you an idea, this stuff, it's pretty much all on the floor upstairs. So um, I'll show you what it looks like now. So here we go. Not quite there yet, but we're a lot closer to being there than we were this morning. That's for a start. And that's all thanks to Catherine from Sort My Space. Thank you so much to her for coming out and helping us at least get a little bit organized. Um, this is where we're at so far. Still a few bits and pieces on the floor, but they're ready to be organized there's some like laundry and stuff we need to figure out where what's being kept what's being chucked etc but yeah as you can see a little bit less cluttered a little bit less messy um there's actually floor space you can actually see the floor it's a great start i'm quickly while while we do this at the gym i'm quickly gonna um make one of these ikea drawers and put it in that hole over there that one and then we can have like boots in there and you can obviously slide the boots out and stuff. And that hopefully that'll make things a little bit easier for the goose and obviously me too. And also there's there's a shelf. There's a shelf, there's a, a little shelf here that needs to go up here. So if I've got time in the meantime, if I manage to make this quickly and I put that in there, I'll put the shelf up as well. And also there's one more thing. Oh, there's another one of these sliding, -y, sliding drawers can put up so yeah i'm not quite sure where that's going yet so regardless of if i have the time or not i don't think i'm going to put that up just yet because i think the goose might want to put that somewhere different but yeah this is where we're at onwards and upwards i guess you can watch me work oh yeah and if you're wondering why i seem a bit chipper it's almost certainly a lack of sleep don't be fooled don't be deceived it's fake news i'm very tired and i think i'm overcompensating anyway Let's get cracking. Let's not waste no time. Let's build one of these freaking drawers. Right, well that's one drawer down. The idea is some of the boots that don't quite fit in the lower drawers, like, whoopsie daisy, I wanna drop you. Like these kind of boots that obviously got a bit of a high, high I don't, heel, I guess, whatever. They obviously need a little bit more clearance. So that was the idea in having that drawer down there, stepping all over everything. Um, what was the next drawer I was gonna do? Oh, the shelf, I'll put the shelf up now. So yeah, watch me work, watch me nene. I apologize, I really do. Right, the goose just texted me saying that she's all done at the gym. So I guess we're not, we're not quite gonna have time to um, do that shelf before she gets back. Oh my God, look at Fiji, how funny is this? Oh, he ran away, bless him, got scared. He was chilling up on this rock, like poking his head up. There he is, hello mate. Stop being a little scaredy cat. Anyway, enough of that. Let's uh, let's go pick up the goose. Oh, look at me! I look the lunch.
I just got picked up by my chauffeur. I think it's on Hello office. there. Look how handsome my chauffeur is. Oh, he's a little bit dirty. He's probably so That's better, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> um, oh, you want to go to Sainsbury's? Yeah. yeah. I think that Sainsbury's might be shut, though. We might need to go to a different shop. What? Crayford? Yeah, it's I think, yeah, I think it shuts at 9. It might be 10. Let me check on your phone. But yeah, absolutely smashed that session. I didn't film because all I did was cycle. So I thought, that's going to be boring to watch. Mm, and there's better people in the gym. So I wanted, I could have time-lapsed it, but there wouldn't have been anywhere to set it up. Do you know what I mean? Bears, bears. So, um, yeah. Same we need to go somewhere anyway because we need to get petrol. So. And we also need to get ice. or Otherwise, I want to buy some iced coffee in the morning. That's I mean, just going to ruin my day. Just put water in, um, the fridge. In the freezer. Like water? Yeah, you know. How am I going to put water in the freezer? No, we need to go to Sainsbury's. Come We've on. We've got ice cube trays. I don't know where they are anymore. They're in the freezer. Um, Lidl might be open. I think it's Lidl or Audi or wherever it's here. It's literally just here. If it's, here, if it's open, I'll just stop here. Oh, to be fair, yeah. we still need to get petrol. I think so. that one closes at 10 anyway, the one that's right there. So, we could just go there. Yeah. What the hell? Oh, um, this is Audi. Yeah, you've gone in the wrong way. I don't know where you're going. I've just followed this geezer. Yeah, why are you going into Aldi? I thought you we're don't going want to go to Aldi. I want to go to Sainsbury's. I thought I'm you said it's not open. No, it's, I said it's open till 10. I just said that. You can watch oh, back the vlog and even just say that no, one I is thought, open till 10. I the thought, one right there. I thought you meant Aldi's open till 10. So you can just go there. No, because I can't get caffeine free Diet Coke from Aldi. Okay. So that's Wait, a fail. Uh, okay. So you've got to go out and then back round. Okie dokie. Um, but you can't take more than 10 minutes because, you know. What? Shuts in 13. You said um, it shuts at 10? Oh yeah, it does, you're right. That's an hour and 13 minutes. <laughs> Silly goose. <laughs> Whoopsie daisy. Um, you don't even know where we are, do you? <laughs> no. <laughs> I don't, you're right. Um, what? What? <laughs> I'm so confused. I don't think it is this way. Which Sainsbury's are we going to? The one that we went to like yesterday. One. Yeah, the local one. Okay. You know where we're going to get there? Uh, I think you do. Straight on then left. No, maybe not. I'll get it on the ways. Okay. Okay guys, be right back. Oh no. There we go. Into the... This is what we got so far. This is apparently really... Are you showing up, sweetie? Sorry. This is apparently really good for doms after the gym. So I got some. Your favourite. I love olives. <laughs> some more butter. These for my this for my dinner. Can't wait to eat dinner. Dora also really likes it. Then we got two big baguettes. One's for me, one's for them. Got some more couscous because I love this couscous. And some parma ham. Yummy. Now we're gonna try and see if we can find little moons. I doubt we will because they're always out of stock. <laughs> See you later, sweetie. <laughs> that was delicious. And my dinner is made. I made like a cheese, pesto, and parma ham panini. Oh my god. I'm actually obsessed. Look at this. Horse thank you, idiots! Flying away <laughs> like a goose in the wind. Like a goose in the wind. Wow. You like that song? That was so pretty. Goose in the wind. That's <laughs> what Sing it again. Going away. Flying away like a goose in the wind. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Top tier. Then I said, babe. So, guys, this vlog is going to be ended here. It's only been like a four day vlog, it's a bit of a shorter weekly vlog. Um, but yeah, we really hope you guys have enjoyed it. Are you putting more lights on? They gotta see me. They gotta see me. You feel me? They gotta see me. They wanna see me. They wanna see me.
What is going on? Oh my god, it's my hair because my hair is so light. It was sparkling in, in the light. Like I, a goose in the <laughs> I thought Sparkle I had. Like a goose in the I thought I had bread in my eyebrow. Bread. <laughs> bread. <laughs> it was the light. <laughs> anyway, guys, we're gonna leave this vlog here, aren't we? Like a goose in the wind. <laughs> Anyway, thank you so much for watching. We love you so much. We appreciate you guys. If you have any feedback for our vlogs, leave them down below. Leave a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. And we'll see you in our next one. Won't we? See you later. Like a goose in the wind.